Hey guys, back in 1877, Thomas Edison introduced his new invention to people, which he named a phonograph. This invention allowed to record sounds on this device and then play them back on it. In general, it was a sensation. People were delighted because they got the opportunity to listen to the voices of their diseased relatives, because their voices were recorded on the medium during their lifetimes, and then they could be listened to after a long time. In general, the device is very simple. As a carrier, Thomas Edison used the aluminum foil, and then just a needle. Today, we want to apply the idea of Thomas Edison and use a plastic bottle as a carrier. I don't know, if we can do this, we'll be the kings of plastic bottles. So, let's make the device like Thomas Edison made. But instead of the foil, we use a plastic bottle. And I hope we can do this. First, we need a plastic bottle. It must be smooth and without reliefs. However, it was very difficult for me to find such a bottle. I took the Coca-Cola bottle, since it has a smooth part without reliefs. I also found another plastic bottle, and it has three strips like this in the center. We may use them as separate audio tracks. We also need a hinge, one nail, three screw nuts, a stud, be sure to choose a little thicker, because too thin will sag under the weight. We also need a box from under the chips or something else, and one plastic cup. We will see and test, if it works with this box, then ok. If not, we will use the plastic cup. But if not this or that, then we combine them and it should work. And finally, here is a wooden rail that will serve as a base. I have a snag on the end of the rail, so I'll cut it off, then attach the battle, put a mark, attach again from the mark and put the second mark. This gives us the length of two plastic bottles. We need to make two more blanks of 15 centimeters. Retreating from the end of the rails, measure 2 cm, find the center, and make the holes for the screw nuts. We glue the screw nuts to epoxy resin, thermoglue, superglue or two component like mine. The base is ready now. We proceed to the next stage, namely, the manufacture of mounting for the reader head.
Now, in the bottom and in the cap of the plastic bottle, we need to make a hole strictly in the center. We already have a hole in the cap, so there is no need to make that. Next, spin the stud to the middle, put on the bottle, glue it, and finish spinning the stud to the end. In the beginning, I made a small handle, now we need to glue it. And finally, stick a nail in the bottom of the cup and glue it in the holder. Well, dear friends, the phonograph is ready, let's test it. First, as you can see, we have a needle going up and down. This is so that you can rewind. And first of all, to scratch the soundtrack and stick the needle as much as possible in the bottle, we need to put something here. To do this, I will use a knife, it is quite heavy. Then, we shout into the cup as much as possible, and at this time we spin the bottle, thus we make the sound track. Then we will lift it, unwind, and without any load, check whether something was recorded on the plastic bottle. Two, two, two. One, one, one. So, look what we got. This is cool. There are scratches, so the process has started. The main thing is that they were soundtracks, not just a scratch battle. Now we rewind, set the needle at the beginning, and try to spin at the same speed, and listen to the cup. So I didn't succeed with the last battle, because the needle was too thick. What I did, I took a sewing needle like this and stuck it diagonally into the cup. Now let's test it again. One, 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 two, 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 three, three, three. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. The scratches aren't as deep anymore, and the rotation does not produce a screech that actually absorbs the main sound. So let's test it. Rewind it. Guys, to be honest, there are no words. This is just a bomb, because despite the fact that it's now the edge of technology, but recording a voice on a plastic bottle is just crazy. Clearly, the quality leaves much to be desired, but guys, the carrier is a plastic bottle. The recording head and the reader is just the cup with the sewing needle. In general, guys, thank you very much for your attention. I hope you liked this video. And by the way, subscribe to my Instagram. I will try to make a post there with a more detailed explanation of how and what is happening. In general, I will try to collect information from Wikipedia, from Google, something from myself. In general, thank you very much for your attention. Love you, hug you, be healthy. Bye-bye.